so where did our family come from? Okay, so we can trace our family all the way back on my father's side of the family. We can trace it all the, way, the family all the way back to London, England. Um, we actually have records that show that we colonized in Virginia um, in 16, around 1650, okay? On my mother's side of the family, we've got genealogy at Texas all the way back to Germany. And um, how do we know this information? Well, we've got it documented in a couple of ways. Um, one way is on my mom's side of the family, on the Klein side of the family, um, her brother, my Uncle George, actually wrote a book on, gene on the genealogy of the Klein family. So we've got that documented. On my father's side of the family, before he passed away about um, seven or eight years ago, he actually went through and did a lot of research and wrote down all his recollections on how the genealogy of his family. So that's how we can trace it all the way back to, to, to England. Um, how many generations can we trace back from your parents? Well, from my parents, we can go back. So my father's side of the family, we can trace it all the way back, at least four or five generations, all the way back to... Um, all the way back to England. From there, you can trace it back even further because we actually came from the Earl of Macclesfield. And since we were, we originated from royalty, you can actually trace it back further if you did more research in, on, on, that, particular, on that particular family. Um, as far as my mom's side of the family, we go back to, we go back to Germany and as far as um, generations, we go back five or six generations there also. And um, you said we come from, uh, from royalty. Can right. you explain that at all? Or yeah, it's kind of Macclesfield. Yeah, it's kind of neat. You can actually look it up on the internet. So the Earls of Macclesfield, there's actually a coat of arms for the Parker family. So let me ex explain that to you. So we're flowers, okay? But my, my father's mother was a Parker. Mm -hmm. And you're David Parker Flowers, and I'm Alec Parker Flowers. So we were named after the Parker family, which was on my mom's, which was on my father's mother's side of the family. Um, so that's how we can trace back um, where we came from and how we got our names. Oh, wow. <laughs> that's cool. Um, so speaking of names, can you recall any specific names or um, any specific places of birth? Yeah, so, so on, my, on my father's side of the family... Um, we go all the way back, I can, I can remember all the way back to my great-grandfather, whose name was Alexander Parker. So Alexander Parker um, actually started a farm back in, I guess it was 1868, that we still have in our family today. It's called Parker Farms. Mm -hmm. um, so that goes all the way back to 1868. And then on my, on my mother's side of the family, on the Klein side, um, my, my grandfather was George Klein, and his family goes all the way back to, um, as I said, Germany. But he, his family actually, when they came from Germany, they actually grew up in um, western part of North Carolina. Oh, wow. Um, so are there any specific places in Virginia? Or, um... Yeah, like we're, we're, we, our family originated where we have a farm that's called Bedford, Virginia. Mm -hmm. um, like I said, that farm has been in our family since 1868. Started with my great grandfather, was passed down to my um, to my grandmother, who was then passed down to my father. Oh wow! Um, and do we have any veterans in our family? Yeah, we got quite a few veterans. In fact, we go all the way back to the Confederate War. Um, my great grandfather Alexander Parker served in the Confederate War. Um, my my grandfather. Um, served in World War I, and he was part of the 81st Inf Infantry in the Wildcat Division. Um, he was actually gassed by the Germans, and he recovered from that to marry my grandmother to continue the, uh, continue the, flowers, or continue the flowers' name. Um, my, my grandfather, or my father, served in World War II, and uh, then on my mom's side, my grandfather there, he served in World War II also, and he was a lieutenant colonel. Wow. And um, did your mother or father, or I know your father um, was in the war, but did your mother have any uh, access or any relation to the war at all? Uh, yeah, my mom grew up on a military base, so she was a military brat. So during World War II, she actually, in a four-year period, she went to 13 different schools. Wow. Because she was going from base to base. So she was going from bases in Maryland, 
in, in also North Carolina. So she moved around a lot. Um, can you tell me any stories about our family or any interesting facts? You know, there are a couple of interesting facts. There's one around the Confederate, uh, around, around the Confederate or Civil War, where my great uncle Robert Parker, who was Alexander Parker's brother, mm -hmm. um, he was serving in General Lee's army, and General Lee had signed, um, had gone to Appomattox and surrendered to, to the Union army. However, the word did not get out quick enough to his army, and he was the last person killed in Lee's army. He was Lee's last casualty. And both armies were so upset about the event because the, the surrender had already been signed that they had a joint uh, funeral for him. Both the Union Army and the Confederate Army all came together for his funeral. Wow. So that's one. Um, on a lighter side, we actually have Mark Twain is a, uh, is a descendant of, of our family. He actually stayed on our farm. Um, it's been documented that he stayed at our at, at our home place, and he was he was a descendant from my great great grandmother. Mm -hmm. um, do we have any historical businesses or um, professions that have been in our family history? You know, we've, we've got quite a few, I guess. Um, we've got a shoe store that started with my grandfather, and he passed it down to my father. And what's interesting about that is my grandfather died. At a fairly young age, and my father, he had just started the business, and it was very competitive at the time. And when he passed away, my father was only thirty years old. So my father um, ended up running the business. He ended up expanding the shoe business in Wilson, and uh, owned multiple stores. And uh, that shoe store was in our was in our family for over sixty years. Wow. Um, do we have any genealogical records? If so. Um... You know, where can we find them and you know where are they? Well, you know, there's actually been quite a bit of research on both sides of our family. So on my mom's side of the family, the Klein side of the family, um, her brother was very interested in our genealogy, and that's how we know that we originated from Germany. And he actually wrote a book, um, it's called The Klein Chronicles, that um, gives the genealogy of the, of the Klein family. Um, on my father's side of the family, um, he passed away about five years ago, but before he passed away, he gave us the gift of his recollections. And he went through and wrote down all the different um, the, the different history of our family. And that's how we can that's how we can trace it all the way back to, to England. Wow. Um, and are we in possession of those the book and the recollections? We we have both of those, yes. Um, and then my final question would be um, in general, where do you think we fit in America's history? Um, do you think we've left an impact and uh, do you think it's you know, how do we fit into the grand scheme of things? Well, you know, when you look at our family, you can see that we really fit in. Look, at, look on my um, father's side of the family. Um, we were there before um, America was America. We were there when we came to Virginia when it was just a colony. So we, have, we, we were in the uh, war of independence. Um, we, we were in the Civil War. We've been, we've been in all the prominent... All the prominent wars, um, very, very patriotic for our country. Um, and the same thing for my mother's side of the family. Um, you, you can trace the geology all the way back. My grandfather was very much involved with the wars. Um, so, so I think we've made impact on, the, on this country, both um, in a historical perspective, but I also think our family's also been known to be very compassionate for people. Um, that's something I'm very proud of. Um, they have they have shown a lot of compassion for people and just trying to do the right thing for people, and that's documented throughout um, the different recollections my father has. That's awesome, man. Thank you so much, Dad. Appreciate it. Thank you, David. Enjoyed the interview. Yep.